Welcome to English with Leanne. Today's phrasal verb is to give up. And we have five definitions. Our first definition is to stop having hope. So if I said, oh, I can't believe you're alive. We had given up on you. We had stopped thinking that you were even alive. Or if you're out with friends and people arrive really late, you might go home and tell your husband or wife and say, they arrived 30 minutes late. We had given up on them. Notice how we often will say on something. You've given up on something. That means you've lost hope about that item, okay? Or that event or that group of people. Our next definition is to stop trying to do something. So if you are trying to get concert tickets for, I don't know, Taylor Swift, you might say, oh, after three hours, we gave up. We were never going to get into that t concert. Okay. Or you might say, well, I worked for a really long time on that question on the test, but eventually I gave up. So it's to stop trying. We also have the definition of to stop having. And this is, to some extent, it's a choice, but it's something you're not happy about to not have. You'll often hear this when someone says, we had to give up the baby for adoption. Oh, you couldn't keep the baby. You had to give the baby up. Okay. Or you might say, I gave up the house. I just, I wasn't going to be able to keep it and my apartment where I'm actually living in a different city. So that might be when you have a family member, a parent who dies and they leave you the house, but you have to give the house up because you can't afford it. You don't have enough money. To give up is also a baseball term. When you want to do sports, you might say that the pitcher gave up a run. And that means that the pitcher, there was a, a bug there. That means the pitcher, the guy who throws the ball, let someone hit the ball and run to base. So that's specific to baseball. Our last definition of to give up is one that I don't hear as often, and it means to stop fighting an emotion or an influence. And when we use this, you might say, after three weeks, he gave himself up to the grief that had been in the back of his mind since his father died. And he's saying that he stopped fighting this emotion. He let the grief take control of him, overwhelm him with sadness. He stopped fighting the emotion. Those are our five definitions of to give up. Good luck using this phrasal verb.